Hello boys and girls, we're at the Life Coach's house today, as you can see in the background, that's my life coach. Um, we come here on a uh, <clears throat> every once in a while to get uh, some meditation, rest and relaxation and find, you know where the uh, pearls actually come from? <clears throat> it's my life coach. She's the one that sets me into the, the mode I need to be for these pearls to fall on my lap to send to your lap. And uh, we can thank her for that. It's... Uh, <clears throat> her name is Gilda, she's my Swedish life coach, and uh, she I met her in a excursion to uh, Syria about three years ago. Yeah, why is a Swedish life coach in Syria? Because she has to go, she goes around the world uh, helping people be able to do uh, good work such as what I do right here. This fine, fine work of bringing you pics every single day. That she's a, she's a hero, really, in the world. If, if, if it's because of people like her that the world is the way it is today, which may be not the best thing, I guess, the way now that I said it. But, anyways, uh, I just I, I I I'm a little tardy for two reasons. I'm I put the pro in procrastination, and the Vatnin trade just happened. I put a video out just now. I'm sure you've already watched it, but if for some reason you haven't because you were you know, waiting in anticipation for my picks for today and didn't want to watch it, I highly recommend you do because the pearls are flowing everywhere. Um, so anyways, I'll quickly go do my picks today because I have to, uh, I have to go do things with my life coach today. Uh, Kings versus the Caps. I'm taking the Caps 4-2. I think the Kings are on the downside here. Um, they, it, it, there was a lot of excitement that they got to change the way they were playing from Daryl Sutter. But it's starting to realize now, the excitement's starting to wear off, and they're realizing that you need some pretty young legs to play like Stevens wants them to play. Uh, Habs versus the Wings. The, uh, I'm taking the Habs 3-1 here, even though they're on the road. I haven't liked what the Wings, how the Wings have been playing uh, recently. Um, it looks, they look a little bit disheveled, and the Habs, on the other hand, since prices come back, of course, look a lot better. When you got the best goaltender in the world, that tends to do that, and he's not injured anymore. Uh, Nux versus the Preds. Preds at home. I'm pretty much always going to take the Preds at home right now. Their team is stacked, and their home and their and their uh, their fans and every the atmosphere there. It's really hard to win. I'm going to take the Preds five two. Um, Knights versus the Wild. Knights burnt me last time. I seem to get it wrong every time with these Knights. Uh, <clears throat> I, I wouldn't bet on this game. Knights could easily win this. Wild could easily win this. I'm taking the Wild at home 3-2, but I'd stay far away from this game. Uh, Stars versus the Hawks. Stars have been looking better. Hitchcock is a very demanding guy. He will not accept a team to be crappy. So expect, uh, if you remember correctly from my video preseason, I said the, wild, the Stars would likely struggle early and become better later, and I think that's going to happen here. Uh, however, the Hawks have been, this is the Hawks back home again after a long road trip, and that's not a good sign. Uh, you just saw it with the, the Flames, who I picked to win that game because I didn't realize that they were back at home after a long road. I wouldn't have taken them that way. I got to really focus, boys and girls. That's why I come to the life coach. Uh, anyways, I'm, I'm going to take the Stars here on the road versus the Hawks because they're home on the first, uh, and I believe they're going to be playing Bishop, so we'll see. Uh, Yotes versus the Flames. Flames are playing unbelievable hockey. I don't think the Yotes have a chance here. I'm taking the Flames 4-2. And the Leafs versus the Oilers. The Oilers are starting to gel a little bit. Uh, and uh, uh, the Leafs have been playing a little off. I wouldn't bet on this game at all. I'm a homer. I'm going to take the Oilers 3-2, and I'm probably going to hate myself for it. Anyways, that's my full 42% boys and girls. I had to do a quick one today. Be sure to subscribe to the channel to get your bat of uh, Jaime's and your uh, pearls of wisdom necklace. Go check out my trade video I just did. It is as good as you would think it would be. Have a great day. Lots of love to you.